And now time to perk. Oh, hey, we got a travel banner. How impressive are these steam engines exactly? Eh, according to Mr. Rock, that possessed power never seen before. His words are mine. Never seen before, you say? Hmm. What's going on? You're a brow wrinkling there, guy. Okay? The strongest person in Ku is a man named Benkai. Do you think these steam engines are stronger than he? Your guess is good at mine, partner. From the way Master Rock was talking, though. Sounds like it's one good. One could win a tug of war because that's a whole gaggle of oiled up muscle, man. So, I show us five Benkai's, perhaps. Hmm? Nah, no, ten Benkai's, easy. You don't even know who Benkai is. Astounding. Then they are truly formidable machines. My god. And we do. Does Benkai even. Do we know if Benkai died or not at the end of his uh, chapter one? That's also a really good question to ask ourselves. Cause I know he stayed behind to fight the guards off so he could escape. The question is, did he survive that though? Oh, you're the clockmaker, man. A thousand, that's fine. We see twenty percent more using collect. Eh. I'd rather have my other person that could save me money when buying you're stuff. You're just who I've been looking for. I'm hiring you to work clock guide for us. All right, let's get the clockmaker. Let's head on back to the factory. Ah, got me. thing. <laughs> Floyd, sorry to keep you waiting. Ah, Particio. And this is... Meet our clockmaker. A clockmaker? Clockites used to make clocks. Makes sense when you think about it, huh? In other words, he can work the stuff. Yep. This fella can bend that metal however you'd like. Anyway, we'll let you get to it, old timer. Temperature control is key to working clockite. Overall, it's quite a simple process. Watch and learn, and you'll master it in no time. Yes, sir. We did it, Particio! Oh, ooh. With this new process, we'll be able to mass produce steam engines. <laughs> Looks like the world's one stop further along on the road to prosperity. My dream is one step closer to coming true, too. It's all thanks to you, Particio. Oh, <laughs> we're nothing. Now. Let's crack open a bottle to celebrate. It's been a long road. My master was the one who invented the first steam engine, you know. We hailed from a coal mining town past its prime. Our mines had all been exhausted, and times were tough. We wanted to find a way to revitalize our dying town. That's when my master came up with the idea for the steam engine. But we didn't have the capital, and our research stalled at the development phase. That's when Mr. Rock showed up, wasn't it? With all the money he took from Ors Rush. And now he's gonna steal all the money from the steam engine and your invention too, probably. We owe him so much. He invested in us, employed us. It's been eight years. And now, finally, our shared dream has tangible results. I remember what you said to me, Floyd. If we can mass produce the steam engine, the world's manufacturing capability will expand tremendously. Prosperity for all, 
and all will benefit, you said. I believe Steam will save my hometown, and all the other places out there that share its fate. It'd prove all your master's blood, sweat, and tears were worth it, huh? It'll happen, Floyd. Only because of your help, Particio. Ah, shoot. It's about time for the boss to come by for his inspection. Oh, you're going to see Mr. Rock? Can I tag along? Of course. I'll go on ahead. I'll let him know you want to see him. Uh-oh. Come by whenever you're ready. Uh-oh. <laughs> you shouldn't say his name. <laughs> Depending on how Rock reacts to seeing Patricio, this can go very badly for you, Floyd. Uh, hey there. Can I have the bill? <laughs> no need for change. I'm feeling generous today. Hmm. Oh, that's right. I didn't even see her there. Ooh, we actually hit her well. Good. The companion has returned. All right. Let's go see if Floyd gets his ass kicked or not by talking to his boss. And let's see if the steam engine is even there anymore now that he has fi finished it. Nope, it's gone. How did I know? Hmm. That steam engine we finished, it was right here. Where could it have gone? I don't see Floyd around either. You there, what are you doing here? Whoa, hold on a sec. There's a good explanation for this. No, there's not. Intruder! Intruder alert! Don't even give him a chance, wow. Let the show begin. Alright, I turn off the LSP because we don't need it anymore. To work. To work indeed, Temenos. To work indeed. Alright, let's go ahead and just luminescence these fools. Right off the bat. Blaze on, oh sacred flame. Note the light, okay. Now it begins. Speed down, how dare. Alright, now we go test out our thief skills. We're going first. Uh... Get a little surprise attack, why not? Let's see if we can kill this man. I'm a step ahead. Good. Yeah, wow. Good job, Akari. Time to shine. Did not stand a chance. Was that? A touch of poison. Didn't, oh, did it poison them? Heck yeah. Let's do go it. for an arrow of fortune. Arrow of fortune. Got you. One job point. He did not have a lot of health left. All in a day's work. Clearly. They even break any of them. Wow. Oh darn. Something smells fishy. Time to explore this here factory some more. Alright. Ah! Got him. I can still interact with them even though they're unconscious. That's kind of great. Alright, so that's also you progress. And the show begins! All right, more guards and one of the lantern things from uh, Octo Where One. Was I? All right, let's go for a lightning bolt. Smite them! Oh, he's also with the lightning. Awesome, good to know. Prepare Not yourself. Not with a sword or bow at all. Watch this finish. Oh wow, you, they're all almost dead already. Oh my god. Do I want to steal anything? No, I don't even want to steal anything. You don't have any all- Oh, you do. Uh, Thrash. Oh, oh Pilfer! Use Pilfer! Get some goddamn money, please. How's this? 62. Alright, that's not a lot of money. Time to shop, up here. Alright, uh... 
Sure, do dagger dance. There. Sorry. And they're dead. Here, what are you doing? That spear is covered. Nice. Awesome. Look at that. I wasn't expecting that. Alright, give me this, please. Empowering Light She. Alright. The chest down there. Aha! 7,000 leaves! Yay! More money! I need it. Oh, there's always the early game. needs so much money in these games, it seems. I need to get New Man to guide. I just, need, I just keep forgetting I have that guy, and I use him. Like, oh, I might as well just get him out of here. So hopefully I'll remember to get a new person. Are we already at the end of this dungeon? Wow, this is a small dungeon. Yeah, because there's Floyd and uh, the tax man. No, you promised me. You said you'd help me bring the steam engine to impoverished towns that need it. Perhaps we made that promise, verbally, non-binding. But you haven't forgotten the contract you signed with us, have you? All intellectual property rights related to the steam engine will pass to the rock company in return for provision of research funding. <laughs> the rock company owns all rights to your steam engine. I'm sure our mutual boss will be delighted to hear that you've invented a better model. Nevertheless, we have no intention of letting anyone else benefit from our property. Period. B but Forget your silly dreams, Floyd. They're not needed here. Silly? Uh, I won't stand for that. This research can bring prosperity to people all around the world. Technology exists to make life better for people. That's what gives it value. Well said, Floyd. I'm in complete agreement. You again? This is an internal company matter. Leave. This ain't just a company matter anymore. You've messed with Particio, now he's gonna mess you up. Eh, true. I am an outsider. But I'm also Floyd's friend, so I'm gonna say my piece. Don't you dare walk all over people's dreams, especially not for personal profit. <sighs> You've made yourself very clear. I see now that you are an extremely inconvenient individual for our company. <laughs> so what are you gonna do about it? A steam bomb? Oh, howdy there, little doggy. <laughs> this is Garnet, the boss's favorite hound. Are we finding a dog as a boss? Garnet here has chased off everyone who interferes with our bottom line. Wow, sounds like a faithful and true companion. P Particio? We should run now. Nope, I ain't moving. Here's a bit of advice, Floyd. Sometimes you gotta fight to make your dreams come true. Come on now, doggy. <laughs> come on now, little. Oh my god! I was not expecting to look like that, but okay. We'll, we'll go with that. It's definitely gonna be a physical attacker, so I'm glad Hikari's here. Okay. Uh, short HP. Might do that right, but no. No. Let's just check for light. Holy light. Illuminate the darkness. Nope. Okay. Time to shine. Okay, you are gonna go ahead and actually you have light and power, okay? This is yeah. what it means to be a star. Uh I don't need this stuff. What I do want though is a lion there. <laughs> That's be great for three of us here. Lion 
Not great for Temenos, but he's fine. Oh, come on. Oh, going to one damage. Good. We're fine. Now it begins. Alright, you got your attack up. Go for a pilfer. Allow me. No good daggers, okay. <laughs> Go for the arrow of fortune. Arrow of fortune. No to arrows either. Forty job points for free though. Oh, that's really good. Where was I? That is very, very good. Alright, go ahead and uh, Elemental Barrage. Good ah, VP, Elemental Barrage. Okay. Fire and Lightning. Okay, cool. Here goes. I got more. Gonna do another Let's one of those. Get another 40 job points. Arrow of fortune. Yeah, oh my god, this is very good. Now then. This is very, very good. Alright, go for that poison axe. A touch of poison. So Get the axe, it. awesome. Now it begins. I, I did poison it too. Wow, that goes off super often. Alright, go ahead and sight. I'm waiting. So he attacks you, hopefully, not anyone else. Oh dear. Alright, go for. Let's do the elemental barrage. Prepare your. Alright, good. Only two more hits and we'll break. Oh! It can use items on us. Neat. I fight for my friends. Let's go ahead and try a surprise attack. So going first here. I'm a step ahead. 4,000 damage, awesome. Way to go, Hikari. Not even broken. Alright, you can go ahead and break him. Go for an arrow fortune that he's arrow broken. We could get so many jaw points out of this Where fight here. I? Uh go ahead and heal us all. Be healed. Thank you. Oh dear. Alright. Uh go ahead and Advanced magic yourself. Though we can have that to make him easier later. It's my turn now. The little wing power, go ahead and Sip a peacock strut now. Peacock strut! That'll be good for both you and uh Temenos potentially. I owe you one. Oh, nice healing. Cool. Prepare yourself. More so for Temenos. Actually, I should just give it to Temenos. I didn't need to do that. That was kind of a waste. Don't think about it. Oh well. Uh, go ahead and do a little pilfer. How's this? Twenty, two hundred thirty-eight. Awesome. I'm just getting warmed up. Arrow of Fortune. Because what else would we do? No, twelve job points. Oh. Uncovers nothing. Heck yeah. To work. Awesome, love to see that. Okay. It does become heal more with this too, so it affects that. Wow. That's pretty good on uh yeah. Alright, go ahead for a fire actually you know yeah, this is a firestorm. Reduce them to ashes. Here goes. Alright, Particio, we still have some adventure skills we can use too. Let's go ahead and do an elemental bomb. Let me, let's see how much this gets rid of. Coming I'm curious right how this works. Alright, because he had two elemental weaknesses and activated twice. Okay, cool. So now he only has two break on him. Uh, we're all good on SP. We're also all going first next turn. Uh, I might as well go for a poison axe again, why not? A touch of poison. Okay, now work up next turn very easy. Alright, I definitely don't need an insight or anything on you. Uh can we can go first next time I do that. Can we steal from you actually? Yeah. Apologies. 
Refreshing jam. Okay, that's worth it. Time to that's shine. a good item. I'll go ahead and break him and maybe even kill him uh, on this, uh, this point, honestly. Would not be surprised. Oh, not dead yet. Skillfully done, Acnea. All right, go pilfer. How's this? We're good on money there. Bring it on. All right, arrow of fortune. Can we use that again now? Oh, we can. In three turns. Okay, if I use this, then it, the turn the actor is a turn, I guess. Okay. Huh. That's neat. Okay. I was wondering how that worked. I haven't collected from you yet. Let's do collect, actually. I'm not playing arrows of fortune. Oh my god, 30,000? I should be doing collect on bosses more often. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and just nuke you. Uh, Radiance, why not? To our cleric after all, primarily. That's how it's done. May the sacred flame guide you, or something like that. Look at all that money. We got so much money. <laughs> I can't believe we just fought the dog. At least thought the guy would be there too. <laughs> This meddling youngster is a real thorn in my side. So, what are you planning to do? Exactly what Floyd proposed. Share this here steam engine with everyone. Technology exists to make life better for people. That's what gives it value, right? You haven't changed, Patricio. Eh, there's Rock. There's the asshole. Welcome to the Rock Company. My company. Mr. Rock. Huh. It's been a while, hasn't it? I'm here to have a word with you. <laughs> Just a word with them, yeah. Oh. Have you finally decided to join my business venture? No. Sorry. Your time's valuable, I'm sure, so I'll get right to it. Mr. Rock, you deceived us, didn't you? <laughs> After you left, poverty almost brought our town to its knees. I heard the truth from Giff's own lips. He said you snuck in that extra line in the contract when we weren't looking. You were the landowner we made that deal with all along. Yes, you got me. I lied to you and your father. I wanted that silver mine, and I was willing to do anything to get it. <sighs> Mr. Rock, I looked up to you. But it seems like you've strayed from the path of righteousness. We're merchants, so let's settle this dispute like businessmen, with a transaction. Sell me the rights to the steam engine. I'll pay whatever price you ask. <laughs> what? You can't be... Interesting proposal. I'm listening. This here technology is an incredible thing, but monopolizing it will only bring tears. Even a merchant needs to understand that some things are more precious than money. You don't say. Like what? Like fighting for a better tomorrow. Things like this should be shared with the whole world. If I own this steam engine, I wouldn't keep it to myself, <laughs> that's for sure. Hear that, Floyd? That's the reason I believe in your dream. Particio. <laughs> you really haven't changed in the slightest. You've convinced me. Let's make a deal. Uh, sir, you can't mean to... 
This is what I'm talking about. So, what's your price? 80 billion leaves. <laughs> yeah, no, we can't afford that. 80 billion? That's outrageous. You could buy a kingdom with that much. Yeah, not even freaking, uh... Oh, Kazan has that much money. He only has three billion. You said it yourself. This technology can make the world a better place. This seems a fair price to me. <laughs> I see now. Clever as always, sir. Hmm. I've made up my mind. It's a deal. You want 80 billion? I'll give you 80 billion. <laughs> what? A merchant never goes back on his word, right, Mr. Rock? Of course. I'll write up the contract now. Of course, yeah, a bullshit contract. The Rock Company agrees to sell the rights to its steam engine for 80 billion leaves. Thank you kindly. Our contract has been made, Particio. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have much business to attend to. Go on. I'll bring souvenirs next time I see you. 80 billion of them. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that day. I overheard it all, Particio. <laughs> the fucking reporter. Yeah, you're that scrivener. Industrial tycoon Rock Brilliant picks business fight with roustabout merchant. A fight to the tune of 80 billion leaves. This will be on the front page of our next issue for sure. It's gonna be big. Oh, I need to tell my brother about this. You show up in a lot of odd places, don't you? But where will you find that much money? It sounds impossible. I talked big back there because my blood was boiling. But there's really nothing much to do except put in the work and build up my finances. W what? It'd take hundreds of years to make that much capital. I've got a hot tip for you, Particio. Oh, that's so. I'll buy it. There's a noble on the western continent that has wealth to rival even the Great Rock himself. Goes by the name of Alrond. I think we've heard of Alrond before. Lord of a town called Wellgrove. Oh, that, that's why. <laughs> well now, ain't that something? I smell a good deal. How many people are in Wellgrove? My god. I've made up my mind. I'm going to see this, Alron. Mind shining my shoes? Oh, it's the yellow guy. Hey there, son. Working hard, huh? Yeah, <laughs> sit right here. I'll shine those shoes to a sparkling sheen. <laughs> Good answer. Yeah, <laughs> I'm working hard. I've got to earn enough to feed my family. You know, with fingers that deft, I bet you could do a whole lot of different jobs. Uh, Particia, be careful what you say to a child. Hey. You have anything you want to do when you grow up? 
Shining shoes is an honest profession, but it's hard to pay the bills with brush and wax alone. Hmm. I want to travel the world. I've spent my whole life in this town. That's why I want some sort of job that'd let me go places, see the sights. That's a nice dream. A big one, too. Yeah. Well, all polished up nice, yellow guy. Ah, thanks, son. Now I can hit that dusty trail with my head held high. Hey, never lose sight of your dream. You hear me? It's a shame the dust is gonna make my shoes no longer shiny. One day, I'll change this world. I'll make it a place where folk can do the jobs they want. I promise you, it won't be long. Hmm. Oh, that's really cool. And best part is, it's not spoilers because you can't read the text. Ah, <laughs> perfect thumbnail opportunity. Breaking news, Vagrant Impaler Particio throws gauntlet at wealthy elite. Patricio announced his intent to acquire steam and rise for any billion leaves. When asked for comment, Patricio responded, Technology exists to make the life, be life of people better. That's what gives it value. But does this daring declaration have steam? Read our next issue to find out. I also love how jazzy his theme is, too. Patricio the Merchant, end of chapter two. A scholar and merchant. Oh, we got trouble at the end of the chapter. 80 billion leaves? I can't even imagine what that would look like. Speaking of leaves, you saved up money to set on your own journey yourself, right? Mind if I, mind if following me if I you did it? I doubt my ways would do much, be much of use here, but... At first, I just helped out people in my village with chores and the like. When they thanked me, I was so happy they were happy that... I was so happy that they were happy as well. Wait, what? I was oh I was so happy that they were happy. Well, you're calling take the money. Yeah, my savings never seemed to go up. That's when Gus gave me a job at a tavern. He couldn't bear to watch me struggle. The rest of the village soon chipped in to support me too. The only reason I was able to save up enough was because of their kindness. They can't even imagine how grateful I am to them. That's such a nice story, Agnia. Oh shucks, Patricio. That sort of thing always talks to the heartstrings. Yeah, take my money. All of it. Live your dream, Agnia. I I've already got enough. You don't have to give me nothing, Patricio. And with that, we're going to decide. Yeah, we're going to Okay, I'm not going to walk around too much. I don't want to actually trigger things. I will end this episode next time. We're going to go ahead and hold on. I want to make sure. Do I actually want this? No. We can go ahead off to actually. We were, where I say we're going probably this place, right? Yeah, no, not, not that one. Winter Bloom to do her level level sixteen chapter two Father's route. They would do uh, Cassie's other chapter two as well. Since we're already there, we have a lot of places. How much? Look at all this stuff in Walgrove. This is ridiculous. So much. Also, the set of comments did not go away, and we also have this now too. Also, level eight. We'll probably do the, the cross paths first, actually, is what we'll do. And then up here. And then down here. And then all the way over here. I know, I've been on this a lot, but there's a lot now. There's so many chapters in this game, it's kind of ridiculous. Hope you all a wonderful time, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.